Hey everyone, how's it going? I just thought I'd uh, share this quick project that I've been working on. It took me a few hours to make, but uh, I'm finally happy with it. So on what you see is two screens. On the left-hand side here, we've got a leaderboard. Now this leaderboard will be shown up on a projector screen or on a large screen of some kind. And this leaderboard has the rank of each team and the team name with their totals. See this big gap in the middle here? That's going to show their running scores. All right, on the left hand, on the right hand side, sorry, we've got the markers sheet. So down the bottom, you probably can't see that right now. I have different markers. This is marker one, marker two, and you'll see they all have different teams. So each marker gets two teams. Marker one has team 15 and 12. That's been randomized in the um, data sheet, which is this one here that pulls all the information. So. Here's how it works. Let's say that a marker, uh, sorry, a team comes along and asks their sheet to be marked. The marker says, "Yep, you got it right. I'll give you a tick." You'll see on the left-hand side on the uh, screen that's being projected, they get a green mark here. Their totals increased up to one, and they get their rank increased. Everyone else is now equal second. Let's say that team 12 comes along and says, "Can you mark my thing?" And the marker says, "Yep." You got it right. So just watch this. Team 12, oh, they're in second place. This isn't going to change anything. Let's say that they go back to their table. They come back. They get another one right. And they'll get another one correct in their, uh, they'll get another checkbox. Take a look at the leaderboard. They're currently in the second row. But as soon as we click this, it's going to update and put them into the first. Team 12 is now first with a total of two. They have rank one. We can keep doing this. They'll increase their rank and so on. All right, let's say that team five comes along, goes to their marker and says, hey, I, I think I got this right. Let's um, see. So they're currently down here. We tick this tick box and that pushes them all the way up to uh, rank three. They keep on going, they come back, they get the second one wrong. So they come back and say they'll pass. The marker can't actually say that they've passed on here, but what they can do is the next time they come up for uh, question three. If they get question three right, they get a check mark. And on the leaderboard, you'll see that they've passed in red and they got three correct. All right, they go again. Question four, correct. Question five, oh, they got it wrong. They're going to pass. Question six, that one's too hard. They're going to pass. Question seven, they come back, they get it right, they get a check mark, they get a green mark, they've moved up a rank to rank one. And they also have two reds filled in because they passed those two. We can do this all day. The way that we've got this set up is we've got eight markers and they're all working in the same sheet at the same time, just in different tabs. As they go along, they um, get more and more questions. You can see the scoreboard updates automatically. Team seven's getting ahead. They're going to get up to first place, aren't they? There they go. Oh, they got one wrong. So there we go. That's what I've been working on the past uh, week. It took me around about a total of four to five hours. I'm not really sure. But now it's a fun little project.